Now I'm going to start with a series of about five or so posters by Eric Nietzsche for General Dynamics. And before I begin, I want to give a big shout out to Jean Daniel Clerc of Gallery Une du Toit and David Pollock of David Pollock Vintage Posters, because a lot of what I know about General Dynamics comes from their knowledge. Now, the General Dynamics series by Nietzsche is considered a masterpiece on the whole and a landmark moment in corporate advertising. General Dynamics was and is one of the largest defense contractors in the United States. They built the first atomic-powered submarine and made a ton of developments in the area of atomic energy during the nuclear age. Obviously, at this point, we're only about a decade out of World War II, and the idea of using atomic energy is both controversial and very delicate. You, you don't really like selling a product that has like an inkling of Hiroshima or Nagasaki attached to it. So they hired Nietzsche to essentially rebrand atomic energy for the world's first atomic energy conference in Geneva in 1955. And what resulted was his Atoms for Peace campaign, which essentially shows various applications for atomic energy that are for good rather than the destruction of human life. 